सो हेलो एवरी वन हाई गाइज वेलकम टॉकिंग टैक दिस इज़ रोहित एंड इन दिस वीडियो इन टूडेज वीडियो वी विल डिस्कस द जॉब सॉफ्टवेयर डेवलपर जॉब बाई एरिक्सन एंड वी विल डिस्कस वट इज़ द वट आर द जॉब रिक्वायरमेंट द जॉब डिस्क्रिप्शन एंड हाउ टू अप्लाई फॉर दिस पर्टिकुलर जॉब वी विल गो थ्रू स्टेप बाई स्टेप सो दिस एरिक्सन इज बेसिकली द सर्विस मीडिया प्रोवाइडर कंपनी और लाइक द कंपनी लाइक हुआई Nokia and uh, Siemens it is like that it is telecommunication provider company so which provided uh, which provide telecommunication services to service providers basically so the role the role is for software developer the location is chennai tamil nadu and uh, if we talk about the opportunity or the role uh, what you will do uh, so it uh, the position basically includes like development testing and uh, automate high quality products perform uh, troubleshooting as needed accountable for test coverage of affected components and functional areas so it is a development related work carry out needed documentation and progress along with the development you have to uh, you have some good skills for documentation and work with agile lean methods okay so uh, this is uh, this particular role you need to, i mean you will be working in a agile team or like that okay now what are the requirements requirements are masters or bachelors degree in software engineering or computer science so here it, it is not mentioned that it is or in computer science so if you have a masters or bachelors degree in any uh, of that any of that field like uh, even if it is mca like you can apply for this particular role and if you are even from electronics and communication background you can surely apply for this particular role uh, they are like uh, flexible with that you shall have good knowledge and experience with java python or cell scripting uh, so you should have knowledge with uh, either java or python and some shell uh, shell scripting will be a plus you shall have you shall have good knowledge in software development environment and tools like eclipse git uh, uh, jarrett maven jenkins so if you have worked with java or python then you may have known about these tools like eclipse git maven jenkins etc you should have knowledge of principle in cloud native architecture and tools kubernetes helm and docker so some of the requirements are also related to cloud uh, and the docker like deployment and all in docker cloud like this you shall have experience in working according to agile principles since it is a the team may be of agile team so you should have experience or at least knowledge about like how agile team basically work so these all you will learn in after i mean joining also they will uh, they will train you somehow so if you if you do not know how agile team works like if you are a fresher so the basically the requirement is from 2021 and 2022 graduates uh, so if you are uh, if you have completed your graduation in 2021 then you can surely apply for this particular role and if you have one year of experience or if you have just uh, graduated in this particular year then you can also apply for this particular role so we see you being creative and like to find new ideas and solution and that have a positive and inspiring approach mindset like all so the job description is like all other software developer uh, role or software developer jobs like you should have some knowledge of debugging testing development also and the requirement is normally for java and python so you should have experience with that some experience with architecture some experience with design principles and like this only so this is all about the job description and what you will do Uh, so you can you can read here why join ericsson like ericsson is uh, have out outstanding opportunities and all and all so basically you know you know that this role is for software developer the requirement is mainly for java and python and you should have some cloud experience or cloud knowledge also so now let's quickly move to uh, like how we can apply for this particular role the job location is currently tamil nadu uh, chennai tamil nadu okay so here is apply now button you can click on apply now and you will be redirected to a login page okay uh, then if you have not created your account then you can surely create your account from there but if you have already created then you can surely log in directly so the uh, the job is software developer job and the job id is this so if i have already shared the the job link in the description so just uh, if you want to apply for this particular role just do it as soon as possible uh, this job may be expire any time okay so now let's move to the sections first of all they are asking for the documents here uh, resume as uh, resume is a really important part if you are trying to apply for any particular role then resume is must so if you have uh, your resume then you can show, apply your resume you can upload your resume here additional document they have uh, given a section for additional attachment so if you have a cv you, you can apply or you can submit a cv here uh, the next section is for profile information some of your fields are already being filled like your name your email id uh, you can fill out your phone number if you have a personal website then you can share here a citizen you can it is a mandatory so you can fill uh, india this role is for india 
the city from where you belong, your particular address basically. The third one field is area of interest. So area of interest, if you if you fill like this is for job category, so you can you can fill this particular role even if you are not. Uh, I mean, uh, if you even if you are not focused on of this particular role, then you can fill this particular form. Uh, if there may be another role or uh, job available, then they will surely mail you regarding that uh, notifications regarding that. So this is particularly about area of interest. It is an optional field. Second is employment history. So if you are already graduated in 2021 or if you are uh, already experienced, then you can uh, fill this particular section like from date, uh, which company have you worked before or like in which industry it is and the job title and basically achievements and responsibilities. Education, it is also optional. You can just fill out your uh, recent graduation, uh, then you can fill out this. Trainings, if you have done, if you have undergo any training, if you have done any training, maybe for any particular language you have learned or any courses you have done, then you can surely mention here. Language skills, you can mention like the language and the fluency level, I guess. Okay, so if you speak English, Hindi or whatever, then you can surely fill this section. The geographical, uh, geographic mobility, geographic mobility here, uh, it is like the questions like, are you willing to relocate? Are you willing to travel? or relocation preference if you want to fill this section or if it is applied for you then you can fill this particular section uh, it is mandatory i guess okay the leadership experience it is optional so if you have done any leadership or maybe a voluntary work or somehow in your college time like if you have uh, leader if you have just uh, uh, lead some particular any any organization or any committee then you can surely fill this particular section uh, okay longest scope of leadership like you if you have any leadership experience then you can sh uh, fill this section uh, although it is optional other engagements like if you have done any special project if you have done uh, if you are done any voluntary work if you are a member to any particular committee maybe in your college time or or apart from your college if you have any mem if you are member from any committee if you have done any voluntary work then you can particularly fill this section uh, these particular these skills are basically this section is for like extracurricular activities or achievements uh, they uh, somehow play a good role in your application. So you, if you have done or this apply to you, then you can you have uh, make sure you fill this particular sections. Job specific information, the last section, how did you hear about this position? You can fill social media or maybe anything like YouTube. There will be option here. Uh, please state your gender, some basic EA information like and the third last one is like, please confirm any conflict of interest in this position. If, we, if there is any conflict of interest, then you can uh, fill this section accordingly. So this is all about the application. These are the sections that you have to fill. These some details you have to fill and then you can apply, you can click on the submit button or apply button after completing this particular form. Your profile will be created. So if there is any another job you want to apply at Ericsson, then you can apply from this profile only. You don't have to fill all these details again and again. So this is all about the today's job uh, at Ericsson, software developer role at Ericsson. Uh, thus, uh, now we, if we talk about the salary range, the salary range is about 4.5 to 12 LPA based upon your experience level or your in performance at the interview. And the interview levels may be simple like uh, you will get a coding questions uh, at the first round and maybe followed by some interview rounds. Okay, this will be, this will be normally the, uh, the path. Okay, so this is all about the today's role. If you have any questions, you can ask in the comment right now or I mean, uh, if uh, after live stream you see this particular live stream or video, you can surely ask your questions. MCA people applicable, there is one question. So yes, MCA peoples are applicable. They have mentioned computer science here, a masters or bachelors. So yes, MCA people applicable. What can count as leadership? Can you give some example? So uh, I mean, if like somehow, if you have a committee at maybe at your college or uh, some any society uh, you, have, you are part of and then you uh, maybe in your final year or uh, somehow in your senior year you are uh, you are a leader or a group uh, or you have leader uh, you have lead a group of people or, or, or a particular society then you can uh, count it as a leadership okay so it can be counted as a leadership you can surely fill this particular section that is a voluntary work or maybe somehow extracurricular activities but uh, it will give a boost to your application so you can fill that uh, that particular section so this is all about today guys so if you have any other doubts or question you can surely ask your doubts or questions in the comments and uh, i will see you tomorrow at the same time uh, in the weekdays and till then be safe be happy and good night and if you are new to the channel do subscribe to talking tech thank you so much see you tomorrow